This is CNN Breaking News. And we do begin with breaking news at this hour. The U.S. Supreme Court with two major rulings this morning. The high court has just thrown out a challenge to Obamacare, leaving the Affordable Care Act intact. The justice has turned away a challenge coming from Texas and other Republican-led states, as well as the former Trump administration, who wanted altogether that the justices block the entire law. In a separate ruling, the Supreme Court also unanimously is ruling that Philadelphia must accommodate a Catholic foster care agency that was refusing to place children with same-sex couples. Big issues at question there as well. CNN's Jessica Schneider is live in Washington with all of the details as they continue to come out. Jessica, focus in on the Obamacare ruling, please. What are the justices saying? Kate, this is big. The Supreme Court saving the Affordable Care Act once again this morning, notably doing it with a 7-2 decision. Conservative justices joined with some of the liberals to say that this latest challenge to the law that was put into place several years ago that has been moving through the courts, the latest challenge is invalid because the justices saying the plaintiffs here, which included more than a dozen Republican-led states, just didn't have the necessary injury or legal standing, as it's called, to bring this case. But the practical effect is that the Affordable Care Act remains in effect. And the 20 million people who have gained coverage under Obamacare, who really may have been sweating this decision out, they will continue to have health care coverage because of the Supreme Court's decision this morning. Now, of course, it's quite possible that Republicans or other plaintiffs might find a way to challenge this law at some point. But for now, it stands. The justice is knocking out this challenge. And for President Joe Biden, this is a major win, of course, because his administration asked the Supreme Court to let the law stand after the Trump administration took the, the other tack on this and tried to advocate to get it struck down. So the court in this case found a procedural way to uphold this law. Uh, conservative Justice Alito, Kate, he was joined by Conservative Justice Gorsuch. They wrote a dissent saying that they were exasperated that the Supreme Court found a way to keep the law intact for the, th the third time since its inception. And they said really the majority had twisted itself into a pretzel here to make this law stand and saying that of course states should be able to challenge the ACA because they're burdened with the costs of maintaining it. But that was only two justices in that dissent and the Supreme Court this morning in a 7-2 decision upholding or keeping intact, I should say, the Affordable Care Act.